Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to my kitchen. Today we're going to start a series of uh, trail meal recipes using the dehydrated food that you've seen in the videos. Uh, dehydrating beef, dehydrating fresh fruit, and fruit roll-ups. Today I've got a handful of recipes. The, the first one being trail burritos. Yes, trail burritos. That is a great recipe. I love trail burritos. Product. I like these flour tortillas. These flour tortillas are delicious and they pack really well. Let me just start by doing that. Two, if you think you can eat three, bring three. If I bring three, I'll eat three. I don't want to do that. The best way I find to package the flour tortillas is going to be in, in paper towels. And again, so, yeah, putting it in there and this stuff rolls up really nicely. Boom, 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 boom. It's not fragile. It'll hold up really well in your pack. You could stick it on the side of the pack where there's that extra bit of room that you have nothing to go into there. Yeah, quick work me on that. All right, that takes care of the flour tortillas. That's done. So let's start with the trail burritos. Gravel. You notice it's the theme in all of these dishes so far is we're using the beef gravel. Our regular 40-ish grams of beef. If you're gonna bring the extra flour tortilla, you might wanna go up to 50 grams. I'm at about 40 grams now. The next item, one of my favorites again, is gonna be the onions and pepper mix. It adds a ton, a ton, a ton of flavor. Uh, let's get our base ingredient, the ground beef in there. 40 grams of ground beef. To start, let's look for about 30 grams of onions and peppers. Bam. All right, right on. 30 grams of pepper and onion mixture. Again, you can, you can kind of break this up a little bit too. It won't hurt. One ingredient that we have not used yet today, bean bark. These are vegetarian, fat-free, refried beans right out of the can. No fat. You spread them right out onto the uh, dehydrator sheets and let them dehydrate. If I remember correctly, I may have diluted it a little bit just to uh, make it flow onto the, the trays before I dehydrated it. Do it. Where are we are now? 17. You see why well, they call it bean bark. It looks like tree bark. Make a nice uh, a stew out of this, a bean bark stew. Also, there's 35 grams of bean bark. And we're gonna... I like a little extra. Come on. Let's not be cheap with the bean bark. Now, I mean, as far as seasoning, we could pop in a little bit of the old taco seasoning. I think the serving size was, was three teaspoons, if I remember correctly. Two teaspoons. That's a teaspoon. We're going to put one in. I don't want it to be, you know, killing me. There's a lot of flavor in the onions and peppers and the bean bark as well. So that'll give it that nice southwest flavor that everybody likes. And again, the little package of Tabasco sauce is going to be good. And another little package of cheese is going to go into this package. So. All right, nice packet of cheese. Ooh. Take ourselves our paper bag again. These will always come in handy, handy on the trail. You get all the air out of it. So you just have to envision that all rehydrated. That's going to be a nice big bowl full of burrito mix. You're going to be stuffing that into those flour tortillas, giving it a little bit of cheese. And don't forget, a little baby hot sauce, Tabasco hot sauce, and a little tiny, tiny jar makes for a perfect set of trail burritos. More kindling for the fire later. How's the water doing? Ooh, almost there. Keep that fire 
rolling. We just had a little snow this morning, so everything is a bit damp. Water's to a boil. It should be just about right. Maybe a bit too much. We'll see. Now this is dehydrated ground beef and the onions and pepper mix. Hydrate. 25-26 after. That'll be ready. Coming up on 15 minutes. And get ready to make the first burrito. Cheese. It's a lot like the chili. The only difference is the bean bark that's in there. It should give you a little more protein, some more flavor, more texture. Mm. Just about perfect. Let's give it another couple of minutes. Okay. completely rehydrated. There's a lot of burrito mix here, so I'm not gonna have enough. Um, Flour with tortillas, I should always bring extra, I guess. But, that's okay. Yeah, we're definitely gonna have a little too much. I could probably scale this down a little. This could be lunch for two. I think that's what we'll call it. It'd probably make more like four burritos in two. Oh, yeah, close it, close up the ends, fold it, and roll it, one down, next one, yeah, this, this recipe would do four, four burritos, easy. Fold in the ends, over, and then over. Let's give it a try. Mmm. <laughs> we are. That's really, really good. To my subscribers, uh, thank you, much appreciation. Um, I thank you for your support. If you have not yet subscribed and you're enjoying this video, you're enjoying these recipes, please hit the subscribe button, hit the bell, how about a like, share with your friends, and let me know who you are. Maybe I can come to your channel and, and see some of your videos and check out some of your good stuff. Right? Thank you, everybody. Until next time.